most of the agencies that specialize in content marketing specialize in this, right? The content marketing pyramid. Down at the bottom, they have some really simple, easy to create content like social media posts or short blog posts. And then up the ladder or up the pyramid, we've got infographics, slide decks, longer blog posts, ebooks, white papers. It's great, right? This approach works great. This pyramid is great. It just doesn't work that great for auto parts and accessories. The reason is we're not selling software or business services, which is what this content marketing pyramid is designed for. We're selling parts. So let me show you an example of a company that does a really good job with their content and their marketing. If I search Mustang Racing Stripes, the first organic search result is going to be AmericanMuscle.com. And if I click through, I'm going to see a category page here that's got quite a bit of information on it. We're actually going to go to an individual product because that's really the best place to see the content from uh, the same perspective that we see it when we talk about content marketing. The first thing I want to draw your attention to is the biggest thing that you can see on the screen right now, which is the pictures. Good photos of the product are immensely important in content marketing. When we add photos of products to uh, the top of a product page, especially if that product page had either really low quality photos or just photos from a data feed, we see huge increases in performance on that page. 20, 30, 40 percent increase in search traffic, 20, 30, 40 percent increase in conversion rate. There's a reason why this page here has such an emphasis and so much real estate devoted to these images. Now if I scroll down the page just a little bit, I'm going to see some more content, specifically a video. Now this video is very nicely produced. Uh, I've got it muted here so it doesn't distract us. They've got a studio, they've got talent, they've got a production team. This would be very difficult for most small companies to produce. Having said that, if you scroll through the video just a little bit, you'll see there's a section where they just show some still shots of some of the different styles and color options. That's something you could very easily replicate uh, with a low budget. Uh, same thing with some of these shots of the sweeping shots or panning shots of the cars. That's something you could do with a cell phone or a steady hand. So, sidebar, you might be able to make a video that's not quite as good as this one, but that's good enough uh, with a low budget. Anyway, moving on to other types of important content. We've got this product description area here with fitment, great detail about the product itself, some emphasis on uh, features and benefits. We've got a good list of everything that's in the box, including tools broken out. We've got an installation time estimate, a difficulty level estimate. This is great content for someone who has never done something like this before. We've even got links to specialized guides, including one that was submitted by a customer, which is amazing. And then if I scroll down a little further, I see some more content. Only this content came from customers, right? This is pictures of people's cars, questions from customers that have either bought or thought about buy buying, and then reviews, which are fantastic. So when you think about content marketing and you work in parts and accessories, you want to think about what American Muscle has done here. Uh, you want to think about product imagery. You want to think about a video that gives customers a lot of detail and information about the product. And then you want to think about making sure that all the questions that the customer has are answered and that there's some social proof from some of your other customers. And also, perhaps most importantly, you want to make sure you have systems in place to gather these reviews, gather these questions, and gather these photos. And that's something that, uh, that we help our clients do.